Happy freaking Friday, y'all. I am in my usual office spot. It is Friday afternoon. I haven't had a chance to come on here and speak to you guys, but a little bit sporadically here and there. Um, but I don't think I've came on all week and just conversated. It's like 3, it's not 328, it's like 320 right now. And I'm having to leave work early. Dang it! Because... I gotta go pick up winter um, they couldn't get her mom because her mom is at work she's not sick thankfully this is not a sick call or a hurt call or anything like that but the air conditioner in the daycare went out and they are having to call parents to come and get the kids because it is registering too hot in the room and they can't accommodate them by putting them in another room because then there would be over ratio so kids gotta go home early they're closing their rooms down so I'm having to leave work and I really didn't want to leave work I really didn't want to leave work y'all I really didn't to leave and go and get her but that's the story of life sometimes being a grandparent a GG a Nana a Papa a G -ma, grandma whatever you want to be called sometimes it comes with double duty Double duty means that you still have to do the same thing you did when you had children. Zay had a game last night and it went really well. I would have recorded, but however, I left my camera at home and then my phone was dead because I had talked to my cuz. We talked to her a little over an hour and I had used my phone up all day. So it was dead. So I couldn't, ref I couldn't video the game and of course it would be an awesome game to where he scored two touchdowns like my son my son he caught a touchdown in stride and then he scored one by kicking he's a very good kicker I'm very proud of him he's very good at the sport he applies himself he works hard for what he does he not only works hard for the sport but he also works hard in school so he's a good kid very good kid so it's really it really like proud of him yesterday and really pleased by how he played and yeah the winter was on another level I do have some clips of her I will insert just from the phone her mom took from snapchat or whatnot videos I'll let you guys see how she acted at the game <laughs> <laughs> Say She was all into it too, you guys. She was their little cheerleader. Little the little of the little of the littlest cheerleader. Yeah. Crazy. So anyway, I'm just like, ah this little girl. But yeah, she's a trip, you guys. Okay, y'all, I got Miss Thing back there in the back. And when I tell you she on another level right now, I don't understand. I don't understand where it's coming from, why it's here, or what's going on. But what I do know is that yeah. she can't come in my house like that. Like, yeah, we like a boy. What? Tell them what level you on today. What level are you on? Are you on 1, 5, 10, 12, 18, 20? What, which one? I think you want level nine. Well, that's what I think. Okay, well. Y'all, she on something else. Yes, you are. I picked her up and they... See what I'm saying? When I tell you twos is around the corner, and they're slowly approaching, and they're going to be a disaster. But I'm going to be prepared for them because I ain't got time for that. You rocking with Gigi and you with Gigi 
and we doing this together. Gigi ain't got time for that. Do you understand? I didn't say nothing about EE. -E. I said GG. G -G. Yes, GG. Me. I'm not a cat. I go and pick her up from daycare and in her room, and then she's telling everybody bye immediately when she saw me, which was so cute. Very, very cute. However, after she told everybody bye, it's just a little precious little boy that's in there, and he had curly hair. She goes to him and immediately wants to I smack him. That. Like, why are you trying to lay hands on somebody, ma'am? And they haven't laid hands on you. We don't do that. Be nice. Nice hands. Hug people. Give them some love. But don't smack them. What they do that at? Well, we don't do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You were in trouble. So anyway. We got ready to go, and they were trying to get her to say um, certain words. And, of course, she wasn't going to cooperate because it's her name. What's her name? Her name is Winter. So, she wasn't going to cooperate. So, we get ready to leave. And on our way going out, as soon as we did get out, they got little windmill flowers in the front of the little school. So, she decides she wants to play with the flowers. I'm constantly saying, come on, Winter, let's go. Come on, Winter, let's go. Come on. She heard her name. She heard my voice. She heard what I was saying. But she still chose not to follow instructions. Why? Because she about to be too so because i didn't want to show my color in front of the school you know and tap tap i decide what term to give you don't oh what you not gonna do is repeat after me ma'am did y'all just hear her blow her breath like i asked her to join this conversation Shh. so back to the story I had to go and pull her away from the flower after I done called her name eight Dad. times. And she was constantly, y'all, I mean, she was Dad. doing those numbers because she was trying Dad. her best. Dad. I shouldn't have to scream, talk to my friends. Dad. Dad. I have to take a moment and pray to Jesus. Oh, we're So I had to approach her and grab her by the hand and pull her out because she didn't want to cooperate. I was a little heated. And I'm like, where's this attitude come from? Where is all of these emotions coming from? Where is all of this uh, personality and stuff coming from? Because last time I saw you, which was last night, you didn't do all of that. So did you wake up on the wrong side of the bed? Or is this a new person that I'm coming in contact with? I mean, because I need my old winter back. I need winter. I need that Winnie Pooh. I need that girl girl that was like my best friend and stuff. Oh, that explains. You must be sleepy. Oh, don't be, don't be trying to out talk me. Do you too? I know what. I know what. You finna go home with me and you finna start cleaning. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna raise you right. You're gonna learn how to wash that window. When I think you got on a stinky, you stink. Damn. 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 Did she just throw herself out? She just starts to feel at me. Do you stink? And then you coming out your seatbelt and stuff, y'all. <sighs> Pray for us. Pray for the pilots as we enter into the two-year-old stage. Because this is something new to me and T.A. You know, it's been a while since we experienced that. You know, Zay 12. Mama! Your mama at work who should be getting you. But because she need a job. Where y'all other peoples? I don't know either, baby. <laughs> now look at the sky. See the clouds? The wind is blowing. But it feels nice out here. It's like 83 degrees right now. It feels really, really good. But the clouds are on some serious grayness today. So you can tell something's coming, like 
what they said in color purple. Yes, indeed, y'all. Uh, something's coming. Good morning, everyone. It is. Eight thirty-two in the morning, and I am here still at Kino's house. I got my little champion. <clears throat> I'm recording. I got my little champion right here beside me, and she's looking at Doc McStuffins in the morning. And I spoke with um, Turches this morning. And um, right now, at my house, we are without power. And I hope that it comes back on <laughs> quickly. Because I haven't done any meal prepping. We got, um, I have laundry that I have to do. This head I have to do. I have to wash my hair. Um, which, that doesn't take electricity to do um because i don't put any heat or anything to it but still like we for dinner today we were supposed to have soup so i'm just i'm stuck y'all kina's over in the kitchen You can't see her, but she is making pancakes and sausage and eggs and grits. Mm, so, I can't wait to eat that. But, yeah, I didn't end the vlog yesterday. We were watching, um, hey, baby. Hi. And something was going on with her last night to wear. Why was you whining so much last night? Yeah, why was you whining so much? What was going on last night? Nothing? And you? Nothing? You was just whining? Yeah. Yeah. Mm. She was on another level last night. She was constantly whining and crying. And then one time she kind of, excuse me, bursted out crying like she was having a bad dream. So, yeah, well, I don't know. She was on another level. So as you guys can still see, I am at my daughter's house still. And it's going on about, it's about 6.30 right now. So um, we finally, oh, I hadn't even, I don't think I even vlogged or, I haven't vlogged. Have I vlogged? No, I haven't vlogged since this morning. So let me sit down and vlog for a little bit and tell you guys what's going on. Well, at my house, I think I told you guys. I don't know if I did. Sorry for repeat myself if I didn't. Okay, this is what's going on. I have been over at my daughter's house. I'm thirsty. I'm gonna go get something to drink while I talk to y'all. Um, because, well, I came over here last night, as you guys know, but I'm still here because we were without power at our house. Our power went out, and um, reason why it went out is because I guess of forceful winds and stuff like that. I had to take a short break and get me something to drink. But yeah, I guess because of forceful winds and stuff. So, um, all of us was over here until we got power. So we just got word that the power's back on. And if you get that, I'm gonna pop. I said no. Yeah. No. No. Do y'all hear that? No. They see you. Yeah. And they gonna see you get in trouble. Yeah. No, ma'am. She's trying to mess with the thermostat. And I keep telling her no. But she keep acting like she don't understand what I'm saying. So anyway, since I got a little time to burn, since they're going on home, 
and Kenna's at work, so I'm babysitting as usual. So I was like, well, I am going to try to make, I'm going to just do some things, make myself useful because I didn't get to do what I needed to do this weekend, which was work on my own home. So I was like, well, let's see what I can do. And I came in here in Winner's Room, which let me show you guys Winner's Room. But I came in here in Winner's Room because I needed to get, oh, she was watching her papa and them leave. So I was like, here, you can watch them leave. We'll just kind of straighten up. I went in a closet and I saw all this stuff and I was like, uh, I saw this stuff and I was like, what the world? So I was like, you know what? We brought our dresser and stuff over. Let's start organizing some of this stuff so she'll know what stuff is. Now, mind you, it probably won't stay that way, but for the sake of the child, let's get this stuff together and let's put away. Give me that. I don't know where you getting crayons and stuff from, but ma'am, um, I was like, for the sake of the child, let's go ahead and get this stuff together. Get rid of some of this stuff. Pack away summer clothes. Put out fall clothes. The least that we can do. So that's what I'm getting ready to do right now, y'all. Is tackle this stuff and see. I believe these are boxes from when Kina first moved out. I think she just saw a closet or empty space and said, "Ooh, I'm just gonna stick that here." And that's exactly what she did. One day she'll appreciate that she has a mother as good as I am because I don't have to be doing this. But I'm doing it because I'm good like that. You're going to fall. You're going to tumble and hit the ground. Get down. Yeah. I'm telling y'all. I told y'all. Two years old. Get down. Go. Sit in your chair. Y'all, it is bright and early in the morning. It's like 8.30. Maybe 8.30. I am so sleepy. Like, I can't even function. It's weird. Like, I have no clue what's going on. Like, I need some energy. I have no energy. I've been taking B12 vitamins that I was hoping was going to give me the energy that I need to just make it. I'm just so tired. And I think I kind of know what's going on. Maybe it's like the keto flu. Maybe this is what you feel like. You just have no energy. Maybe that's what it is. Because I have no energy. Like right now. I'm supposed to be walking into the building to get to work. But I pulled in the back of the building. I'm literally in the back of the building. Parked underneath the tree. I feel like I need at least 30 minutes to sleep. That's how bad I feel like. I need 30 minutes. <laughs> Crazy. But that's what I feel like, so... I am going to lay right here in my car, listen to the birds, and take me a 30 minute nap because I need it in my life. I need it in my life. <laughs> Weird. I got to get this weight off of me. And I finally have kind of accepted the low carb and it seems to be working, but I'm drained. I'm drained. And I'll probably go in here later and see if. Somebody can give me a B12 shot because I need some energy. Say nothing, Winnie. Nine. <laughs>